Shalom Aleichem, and welcome to Black Gods of Yahweh Media. In the power of, in the glory of, in the good of yud Hey wav Hey Yahweh. In the name of yud Hey wav Hey, Beit Nun Sofi, yud Hey wav Hey, Yahweh Ben Yahweh. This particular video is going to be one of most importance. I was listening to the Messiah of the nation of Yudei Wave Yahweh, the tribe of Yahweh, and those that believe that they are Yahweh's people who are called by his name, not respective persons, meaning you as a Hebrew Israelite must change your name from your slave master to a Hebrew name that is one likeness unto Yahweh. In listening to our great master teacher, I came across some important information, and I'm going to go to Ezekiel 33, 4 through 6. Ezekiel 33, 4 through 6. If you do not have your Bible present, you can just come back to this video later on and then go through this scripture yourself or come back and follow along with your Bible. It says, Then whosoever heareth the sound of the trumpet, and take it not the warning, if the sword come and take him away, his blood shall be upon his own head. Meaning that if the warning comes to you, and you do not heed that warning, and the trumpet sounds, then what happens to you is your fault. What is the warning? It is the knowledge of Yahweh. The name of Yahweh, the son who came bearing that name, the law, statutes, and commandments, and fervent charity. Moving on to five. He heard the sound of the trumpet and took not warning. His blood shall be upon him, but he that taketh warning shall deliver his soul. Once again, when you encounter someone in the knowledge of Yahweh, who is trying to save you and speak this truth and is trying to show you what Yahweh has in store for you by believing on his name, by learning who the Messiah is who came in the name of Yahweh, his full name. Once again, the law, statutes, commandments, judgment, and having fervent charity to save yourself. Then your soul shall be delivered. It's going on to six. But if the watchman see the sword come and blow not the trumpet and the people be not warned, if the sword come and take any person from amongst them and take any persons from amongst them, I'm highlighting that to a point. He is taken away in his iniquity, but his blood will I, Yahweh, require at the watchman's hand. That means that if you are in the knowledge of Yahweh and you're sitting around stagnant and you're not being a watchman and blowing the trumpet, meaning spreading the knowledge of Yahweh to save someone so they could be put in the book of life and live for eternity, then it says that Yahweh requires your blood. It is on your hands. So that's some very important stuff. These three scriptures in Ezekiel 33, 4 through 6 is saying how important it is for you in the knowledge of Yahweh to do the work. That's why the scripture says faith without work is dead. You are best to believe that the work that you do for Yahweh, that is your charity and it wipes away a multitude of sins. We all have faults and secret faults, but doing the work of Yahweh brings mercy upon you. If you are a watchman in this knowledge of Yahweh, you must be spreading this truth. That means over the clouds, social media, mass media, in person, you must do the work. You must spread his knowledge and be a watchman for Yahweh. So it says, and take any persons from amongst them. Ezekiel 33 and 6. Who's amongst you? Your friend and your family. 
your friends and your family are amongst you. We understand that the scripture says that if you are not willing to give away your family and your friends, you're not fit for the kingdom. But Yahweh is saying those amongst you, your friends and your family, it is your responsibility to spread this so they can be saved too. Yahweh understands you care about them. But you're not caring about them if you receive this information and you know it and you're just sitting around and say, oh, well, they don't want to hear it. It doesn't matter. You have to keep feeding this information. I do this all the time. It gets tiresome. But we are appointed from Yahweh to do so. It is very important. This is a major task, a charge that we have been given by Yahweh to be a watchman and to spread his message and his word so that others like us can come into the fold and be saved. This is Black Goss of Yahweh Media. Shalom Aleichem. Until the next video. Hallelujah Yahweh. Hallelujah Yahweh. Ben Yahweh.